Hello guys, in this video I'm going to upgrade this uh, HP Pro 3120 from Windows 7 to Windows 10. Basically it's uh, asking to be installed and uh, yeah, I will try it and see how it works. I've already made an image of the hard drive as it is in this moment and if I don't like uh, anything about it I can go back to that image. I will not uh, even be bothered to uninstall Windows 10. Basically I just put the image back. So it will be exactly like it is now. So yeah, without uh, further introductions let's click on get Windows 10 and see how that goes. Most likely this process will take uh, quite a long time. So I will uh, stop the video from time to time and only continue when something uh, interesting happens. So we don't have end up with an extremely long video like I usually do. And if you are wondering why I keep doing uh, Windows 10 videos is because I'm trying to convince people to upgrade. I haven't had one system that uh, had uh, problems with Windows 10. Basically all my upgrades worked perfectly with minor things like, uh, I don't know, uh, needing to uh, delete a network that was uh, a wireless network that was already known and remake, redo the connection, re-enter the password or uh, on some laptops uh, the scroll from the side of the touchpad uh, is not working anymore but those are things so minor that uh, basically the fact that Windows 10 works faster on those machines than uh, Windows 7 does yeah, <laughs> go for Windows 10, this is my opinion and I'm standing behind it. So, yeah, we will continue in a moment when uh, download completes. This window appeared next. Let's click accept. And, uh, yeah, let's see how it goes. Still downloading something. Okay. It seems to be finished. Start the upgrade now. Most likely this will restart several times during the update. So, yeah, we will let it do its thing for the moment. The PC rebooted. Now it's copying files. And, uh, yeah, it will last at least one more uh, half an hour. Maybe even an hour. Hopefully not. We will see. We made some progress but we still have uh, a bit to go. So, we will wait some more. The setup uh, is almost finished. Basically, I will just uh, customize the settings as I don't like the <laughs> standard ones and then we should uh, be in Windows and we are in it seems Avira detected the upgrade to Windows 10 so we will update it and uh, yeah let's see notifications Windows is adding some features okay at this point I will uh, 
just uh, see if, if the drivers got uh, installed all of them you can see windows is activated and uh, yeah it recognized all the drivers from windows 7 or had uh, drivers for this particular uh, configurations uh, configuration sorry so yeah i will play around uh, a little bit with uh, with this pc and windows 10 and uh, then i will come back with a conclusion if windows 10 works perfectly normal or has some issues okay checked everything all programs start and run perfectly at the moment i think it's doing some updates because uh, there is lots of hard drive activity not so much uh, cpu and memory i will let it settle down and give you the conclusion but yeah 99 percent windows on this on this uh, hp pro 3120 windows 10 works perfectly so upgrade to it without uh, any problems it took about uh, half an hour for uh, the disk activity to, to go uh, down but uh, we had some guests so i didn't manage to record this until now so basically windows 10 working absolutely perfectly on this computer and uh, i must uh, honestly say that it is uh, starting up faster with windows 10 than it did with windows 7 although this is just an update and not a fresh install so i don't know probably it is uh, doing some caching so it starts from those files i don't know it is faster than windows 7 and it is running perfectly so if you have this pc you can upgrade uh, without any problems at least with uh, this configuration that i will show you in a moment again so yeah uh, okay guys thanks for watching uh, if you have any questions feel free to ask in the comments Give this video a like if you found it useful, watch my other videos, subscribe and see you again next time. Bye!